I've always had a soft spot for the bone shaker. It's like an antique you can drive around in. Let's go. Oh, oh, did I tell you about the Hot Wheels 50th anniversary back in 2018? No, but I have a feeling you're about to. They did a sweet black and gold series with matching livery and a whole collection of other 50th anniversary inspired cars throughout the line. They also started the Hot Wheels Legends Tour. Custom car builders compete to show off their best designs. Then Hot Wheels picks the best one and makes it into a 1 to 64 scale toy. That's how we ended up with the two Jet C, Nash Metropolitan and Custom Trans Am. Sometimes the opposite happens, where a toy car gets scaled up into a real one. Hot Wheels have made more than 20 full-scale cars and used them to break three world records with actual corkscrew jumps and double loops. <laughs> it's wild. loads of amazing designers had worked on Hot Wheels. Mark Jones, Phil Wheelman, Brendan Petuski, Fraser Campbell, I could go on and on. Between them, they made loads of creative casting designs. There were lines like the Toon, Hard Nose, Cruise, Fat Back, Torpedoes and the Drop Top series and the Realistic series if that was your jam. Nice. Now, let's shake up that bone shaker a bit, shall we? I know we're 50 miles above Mexico, but a little Baja expertise won't go astray. The Baja bone shaker is a modern take on the classic bone shaker design. done heaps of cool stuff outside of model cars as well. You mean apart from the Horizon Festival? Exactly. There was an animated movie in 2003, a TV series called Hot Wheels Accelerators in 2005, and tons of video games going all the way back to an 8-bit version in 1984. Oh, those were the days. I get this. Back in 2014, they hooked up with the University of Southern California to develop pedometry, an educational curriculum to teach kids science and maths. Seriously? I know. And there's me, stuck in a university lecture on advanced analytics with no toy cars or anything. So unfair. Thankfully, our cars have real suspension.
began, there's been 20,000 different designs and at least 8 billion cars have been made. Impressive, right? But the rare cars are still worth a lot at auction. An ultra-rare prototype of the 1969 Volkswagen Beach Bomb sold for $72,000 and some collections are estimated to be worth over a million dollars. In the early 2000s, several collector conventions began to spring up around the world where fans could meet up to buy or sell cars, show off their collections or just talk about their hobby. Nice! Now the Baja Bone Shakers ground clearance is pretty good, but... Monster Truck Bone Shaker! Amazing, right? <laughs> Climb in and let's do this! I figured we could finish the documentary in style with an epic stunt run in this beast. Don't ask how we got it up here. Fun facts have you got on this thing? Can we do epic stunts now and do facts later, please? OK, OK, fine. In 2018, Hot Wheels launched its Hot Wheels Monster Trucks toy line and an exciting live event came a year later. This line has both amazing original designs and Monster Truck versions of classics like the Bone Shaker and Twin Mill. Now this is a Hot Wheels finale. It's not the same without the flame. Very nice. We'll make a hot wheels pro of you yet. Thanks. Here, have a Mustang. 